Our top focus this hour, the first cases of Omicron have appeared in Brazil and in Latin America. Brazil has confirmed two positive cases of the new variant Omicron. Brazil's Sao Paulo state government announced on Twitter that the two, two travelers arrived from South Africa have tested positive. The contacted persons are a 41-year-old man and a 37-year-old woman from South Africa. The two landed in Brazil on the 23rd of November. And before returning to South Africa, the two made a new test on 25th of November. Reportedly, both were presenting mild symptoms at the time of the PCR test. The two reported preliminary cases were, uh, the two imported, pardon me, preliminary cases were confirmed after genetic sequencing. Since then, they have been in home isolation and under monitoring. It is not yet confirmed whether the two have received anti-COVID vaccines. A detecção de casos da nova variante Ômicron no Brasil era só uma questão de tempo, assim como provavelmente irá acontecer em muitos países ao redor do mundo, pois é uma variante que está associada a alta transmissibilidade, é uma constelação de mutações que dão a essa variante uma possibilidade de infectividade muito maior quando comparado às outras variantes anteriores, e provavelmente já circulava no sul da África há algumas semanas. The health authorities of the most populated state of Brazil have reported that a suspicious cause is also under analysis. A passenger from Ethiopia visited South Africa. To prevent the spread of the new coronavirus variant, Brazil closed its air borders to six African countries on Monday. Omicron was first identified officially in South Africa last week, but the data now shows that it was circulating before then. Now, the new data from the Netherlands has shown that Omicron variant was present in Europe before the first cases were reported in South Africa. It has since been detected that more than a dozen countries, with countries now on alert for the Omicron variant. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.